what is good youtube welcome back to another video man but um yeah today's gonna be a little bit different of a video right now we're headed over to this little shop that hit me up supposedly they have some pretty cool stuff up in there so we're gonna go check it all out but if y'all are new oh my god that vet is so clean but anyways man uh if y'all are new to the channel and not already subscribed, make sure you drop a like, comment, and subscribe. If y'all did not check out last video, man, it was a pretty cool video. We linked up with uh, Rick Fairless and Butch Patrick. If you don't know who Butch Patrick is, he's a movie star and uh, like TV star off a show called The Munsters. And I actually own The Munster Coach, so it was a pretty cool, neat deal. Um, and shout out to Rick Fairless again for, for helping set everything up and hosting us out at uh, Strokers here in Dallas. But yeah, man, today we're going to go check out some old schools and some other things like that and see maybe what we can, uh, maybe we can get done. Maybe it's a good shop that we can use. Um, I am currently looking for a pretty nice old school, um, probably like an older Corvette, Camaro, something like that, that we can have fun with on the channel and uh things like that but we're just gonna see how everything works out maybe we find something up there for sale but at worst case scenario at least we'll find a good shop and see some pretty cool cars today but yeah man just like that i'm gonna go ahead and uh stop yapping uh but yeah make sure drop a like comment subscribe turn on your post notifications just make sure some to all so you do not miss a video and just like that man let's get straight into it ha Alrighty guys, so now we just pulled up to Ace Car Care in Plano and we got Ron with us about to show us around the shop right here. What do we got going? Uh, a few little treasures, 84 Olds, Cutlass, right here. Low Miles. Okay. Uh, I think it's a second owner. She only drives it on weekends, imagine that. Oh, okay. Uh, so it's an older older lady? Yep. And six look at this thing right here. Back. Man, this thing is clean. What's under the hood of this thing? This is a 3.8 V6. V6. Electronically controlled carburetor. Dang. Man, this thing is looking good. What y'all doing to it? Uh, actually, I'm overhauling the carburetor. Oh, okay. Getting a nice little nice little carb done. What we got here? Uh, 72 Ford Ranchero. Okay. This is uh, the only year they use this front end on a Ranchero. It's getting a 351 Cleveland belt. Okay. Something just a little warmer than stock. And this thing is nice. Got everything the story behind this, his dad had one when he was a kid, had to have another one. So oh, okay. an adult, this is what he wanted, that's what he's getting built. Dang. Yeah, it's looking good. It's getting there. We're Coming good. around We're for sure. Are blocked back. We're doing some custom heads. Okay. It'll be real nice. Yeah, this thing's looking good. Got the whole effect going. And y'all got all the room back here. What's going on? Seven bays all the way across. We do Asian, customs, classics, domestics, you name it. Okay. 66 Mustang. We did AC upgrade on it. Let's go take a Dash. look at that. You said 66? 66. We got a 66 Mustang. Man, look at this thing right here. Looking clean with the red interior. Not a pony pack interior. It's off of ours. Super nice. This thing is clean for sure. And we got the nice rims. Everything looking good on this one. To the to the nice beauty back here. What we got going on 57 with fifty-seven Chevrolet. Fifty-seven she, fifty-seven Chevy, man. What we got under the hood of this thing? Street Rod Fair, three eighty three stroker. Man, look Launch at this thing right system. here. It has uh, fuel injection. Man, this straightforward seven hundred R four transmission. Okay. Full instrument cluster. Yeah, the whole shebang. Interior, it's a cruiser. Man, this thing is clean, man. Look at this. Oh my goodness, and the interior. Oh, man, got that old school. Look at this thing. Oh, this thing is so clean in here. Got the whole effect. Man, you got the CDs and everything. Got the nice little, oh my goodness. And we got the back seats. This thing is looking good. Nice and clean for sure. This thing shut. Man, almost scared to touch this thing. Thing is, thing is so clean. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, this thing is clean for sure. So we do everything, but we do so y'all do y'all do it all. Uh, we do a lot of tween cars. They're not really vintage, not really late models, just like this '89 Ford. This thing right here. Van. Uh, oh, the van. It's actually a cool looking van. Injected 302. That used to be a thing, you know. It uh -huh. Used to be a van culture thing. That's kind of where that came from. Okay, makes sense to me. But yeah, and that's still a cool van. I think it's sick. See, so I got all this down here too. All this down here too. We got two techs building the rear end. Nobody does differential work anymore. Never. 
got a K5 Blazer with an LS swap. Okay. The customer brought to us with a grocery list of things that he needed fixed. Right. Uh, LS. This thing is cool. Look like at this thing right here, man. This thing is sick. All the goodies. What is this? We got an old school, old cutlass. For sure. We're getting uh, aftermarket air conditioning. Look at this thing right here, man. So clean. Got all the rims. Everything. It's got a clean interior. I think it's nice. It's looking good. What is this above me? This is an old 442. Actually, it's a cutlass. A cutlass? Uh, 350 rocket olds. Okay. And y'all got this thing torn down. Yeah, he's doing the aftermarket air conditioning in this. Oh, okay. okay. The original box. This was a factory AC car, but they're always minute school at best. Right. Vintage air systems are a lot stronger. So, uh, yeah, I got the inside and box ripped out. It's getting a new inside and outside box, condenser, light model compressor, and some wiring. Okay. Uh, the car's been wired by another shop. Uh, we did uh, a Dakota Digital cluster on it last year. Mm -hmm. It's one of those things every year he does something. Okay, AC yeah. AC is important. AC is definitely important. So, yeah, we, this, is, yeah. this is Ace Car Care. Need literally anything done, make sure to come check them out here in Plano. Man, this Camaro is sick, though. It's a nice car. We're waiting for a power steering rack for this. Okay. Power uh, steering. It's a oh. It's Chevelle 72 SS 454 four speed with a real glass window, which is extremely rare for a car. Dang. This thing got the whole shebang. This thing is clean. And look at that paint on this thing. This thing is just shining. My goodness. Yeah, you can see all the flake. That, that paint job probably 10 years old. Holy smokes. Man, he'd be taking good care of this one. This thing is clean, man the whole thing and look at this interior with the actual four speed yeah that right there is sick that's nice car that's super clean super super clean it drives as good as it looks <laughs> that, that's a good thing for sure what well, we got going over here oh this back to the empty bay we do uh we do customs classics we do fuel injection we do old school carburetors in fact that clicking noise is the feedback carburetor for that little olds over there oh, okay so yeah we run and we run the gamut well yeah just like that ace car care here in plano if y'all need anything for any of y'all's cars make sure to come check them out and they got some pretty cool stuff up here so uh yeah make sure to come stop in you can see ronnie john anyone <laughs> anyone at the front they'll get you taken care of but yeah Alrighty, man, and just like that, I forgot that I actually did not do an outro. I kind of just wrapped it up and we chopped it up for a little bit, but I hope y'all did enjoy. I really do appreciate all the support and love y'all been showing on the recent content, man. Y'all have been going insane, so I really do appreciate it. It means a lot, especially because the channel's had a lot of ups and downs this year, so seeing it come back around and y'all really enjoying the content, I do appreciate it. All the likes, comments, everything like that. Um, but yeah, man, that's gonna be it for today's video. Make sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe. And just like that, um, I'll catch y'all later this week, boys. <clears throat> and just like that, I'll catch y'all later this week. It's me, boy, and I'm out. Ah!